The Norwegian Center for Offshore Wind Energy, NORCOP, has invested in a unique facility for motion compensation research. First, let's start with an example of a six degree of freedom motion compensation system. Here we see the MOTS system, which uses an industrial robot protected by a jacket for six degree of freedom motion compensation. The robot is mon mounted on a service vessel for an offshore wind turbine foundation. Here we see an operator being safely transported from the moving vessel onto the fixed wind turbine structure. One challenge uh, with, the, with this application is to protect the robot from the harsh environment. In Norkov, a new motion compensation laboratory is currently being developed. This shows the building facilities where the new lab will be made operational. The lab will consist of two steward platforms and a hydraulic vehicle loader crane. This shows the lab setup with an eMotion 8000 and an eMotion 1500. Next we will show some simulations which will demonstrate capabilities of the new compensation lab. Here we see an industrial robot manipulator mounted on the big steward platform. The red object is a load and the goal is to land this load on the second steward platform. So this example demonstrates transport of personnel or loads from one floating vessel to another. The second step is fixed point compensation. Here we can see that despite the base of the robot moving with the vessel, it is able to keep the red load stationary in the global world coordinate frame. The base of the robot here moves with 6 degrees of freedom. The third step is to lock the load on the moving target. Here we can see that the red load has a constant distance above the second steward platform. In this case it's a simple motion of the second steward platform, it's only heave direction. The fourth step is to demonstrate landing of a load on a moving target. And here we see now that the set distance is decreasing, so the red load eventually will be landed on the second steward platform. In this case we have full six degree of freedom motions on both steward platforms and the robot, being a full six degree of freedom manipulator, is able to fully compensate for all six degrees. Next we are zooming in on the receiving vessel, or the smallest steward platform in this case, and we can see that both the position and the orientation of the load is constant relative to the second steward platform. The real equipment, it's an eMotion 8000 from Bosch Rexroth. This is a demonstration with a full load 8000 kilograms in the factory acceptance test in June 2012. Next we show some experiments with a small steward platform, the eMotion 1500, at the University of Agder in Norway. The goal here is to keep the a hydraulic manipulator stationary in that red point while the steward platform is moving. Finally we show that the steward platforms can also be used to compensate errors from a moving vessel with the uh, LIDAR measurements. The complete facility is expected to become operational second half 2013.